Sarah Brent, our scouts have just identified three separate fleets approaching this platform. With Duran having disappeared, and the bulk of my brood still on the surface of Char, you'll need to hold off the invaders by yourself. You sound worried, Kerrigan. Have I caught you at a bad time? Not at all, Arcturus. How'd you manage to scrape up your new fleet? Been raiding the salvage dumps again? I called in a few favors, made a few concessions. You'd be surprised to see how many special interest groups in this sector want to see you dead. I'm sorry to have to disappoint your new friends, Arcturus. But you really shouldn't have attempted this stunt. It'll take more than your three little fleets to bring me down. Three fleets? Don't play dumb, Arcturus. I've already spotted the other two fleets. Kerrigan, this is Artanis. My brethren and I have come to avenge the deaths of Phoenix, the Matriarch, and all of the other Protoss who fell before the Swarm. It is long past time you paid for your crimes against our people. When it rains, it pours. <laughs> the Protoss too. Care to take a guess as to who the third fleet is? No need to guess. It's Dugal and the remainder of the UED fleet. That is correct, Carrigan. This is Admiral Dugal. I am giving you one last chance to surrender your forces and submit to the sovereign authority of the United Earth Directorate. Gee, that's a tough one, Admiral. You'll have to let me think for a minute. You know, Admiral, I think I'll just massacre your remaining troops now and watch you die in agony. How would that be? You vastly underestimate me, my dear. I don't think so, Admiral. You see, at this point, I'm pretty much the queen bitch of the universe. And not all of your little soldiers or spaceships will stand in my way again. So be it. Kerrigan, I have prepared to offer terms of surrender. It is my wish that you allow my men to leave. You're not in a position to offer me anything, Admiral. And I don't take prisoners. I'll tell you what. Turn your remaining ships around and start heading back towards the Earth. I'll even let you have a head start before I send the swarms after you. It'll be interesting sport to see how far you get before you die. Savor is the victory, Kerrigan. For the Protoss will never forget your treachery. We shall be watching you. Congratulations, Kerrigan. You've beaten me again. Just remember that I'll be out there, waiting for you to slip up. Because sooner or later, you'll make a mistake. And when you do... Once again, I stand atop the broken bodies of my enemies. Victorious, but not unscarred. The Earthborn Directorate has been destroyed, and the Overmind lies dead and trampled beneath the ashes of Char. As for my unlikely allies, I think that I shall allow them a reprieve. For in time I will seek to test their resolve and their strengths. They will all be mine in the end, for I am the Queen of Blades. None shall ever dispute my rule again.
Dearest Helena, by now the news of our defeat has reached the Earth. The creatures we were sent here to tame are untamable, and the colonies we were sent to reclaim have proven to be stronger than we anticipated. Whatever you may hear about what has happened out here, know this. Alexei did not die gloriously in battle. I killed him. My pride killed him. And now my pride has consumed me as well. You will never see me again, Helena. Tell our children that I love them, and that their father died in defense of their future. Au revoir.